The cheaters in Auckland, they'll entertain, but they'll lose. They took a pounding psychologically with that last minute defeat against the Highlanders. The Highlanders, they go to Pretoria, they'll beat the Bulls. They won't be as emphatic as the Crusaders did, but they'll still win comfortably. The big one in South Africa, it's in Port Elizabeth. It's the Kings up against the Sharks. 1917, the last time they two played in Durban. Kerwin Bosch, he kicked that last minute penalty to win it. He's not there. It's a big pity he's gone with their sound of 20 side. They're expecting 20 to 30,000 people in Port Elizabeth. Try and make it 35, 40,000. It's going to be the biggest game the Kings will host for the remainder of the season. I'm expecting the Sharks to win though. I'm expecting them to win by 10 to 15 points and keep up their playoff challenge. And then overseas, it's the Lions, the high riding Lions. Their last match of the Australian tour. They comfortably beat the force. They comfortably uh, won against the Rebels. I don't think they're going to win against the Brumbies. It pains me to say it. I hate betting for an Australian team, but I think the Brumbies are going to just edge it against the Lions. I've got this crappy feeling that the Lions are going to drop this one. It won't be a train, train smash for the campaign, but I've got the Brumbies to win by three to five points. That's how close it's going to be. Everyone's saying, send shivers. Ooh, the All Blacks. It's the best draw we could have got. For 2019 World Cup, the Springboks and the All Blacks in the same grouping, win or lose. We don't have to play them again until a potential final. We know exactly what we've got. We also know that we've got Italy, which brings the question, Brendan Fanta, Italy or South Africa? After the French series, he's going to have to make a call. He can't be in both camps. And then 2023 World Cup South Africa, the government finally endorsed it. Why don't you endorse it? Let's have it here where the Guinness is a lot cheaper than Ireland and the beer is a lot cheaper than it is in Paris.